This is the Dallas City Store, where surplus items the city purchased are sold. You can buy things like headphones and briefcases here. You're not supposed to be able to buy drugs. And we're hoping that this doesn't happen again. Dallas Police Sergeant Warren Mitchell explains a mix-up while remodeling the department's evidence room led to more than 100 bags filled with drugs ending up here. The whole, whole property room is kind of going under reconstruction, to be honest with you. So, you know, you, you're having to move items from one location to another location. You got in just a handful of employees. That property room was getting new shelves. They uh, removed all the drugs and put them in the, uh, in the vault, so they thought. But workers missed one drawer, a drawer packed with evidence. It was 123 bags of exhibits, each containing various drugs such as cocaine, marijuana, methamphetamines. Luckily, before the cabinet was sold, a worker at the store noticed the drugs inside. A worker called police who quickly realized the mistake. It was a, a terrible oversight by, by someone in the property room. Uh, it should not have, have happened. We asked several times if we could go inside and see the store, but we're told no, it's closed, while employees go through the inventory. Rich Matthews, The Associated Press, Dallas.